Hey everybody! Okay, I am so excited to show you how to DIY these hologram glitter nails. They are the coolest things ever. I mean, look at them. I get so many compliments on this manicure whenever I wear it because I really do think it's just pure happiness on your fingertips. You can obviously do your own color palette or a single color of glitter, but today I'm going to finish the rainbow palette that I've already started on my right hand. I recommend using at home UV gel products for this nail art because it does make the manicure last a couple weeks, which is awesome. But you can use regular polish if you do extra coats of the clear polish at the end to seal in the design. All of the gel products that I'm using are available online or at your local beauty supply store, so they're very accessible. You're gonna need both fine and hexagonal glitter in matching colors. And I'm gonna use these sets from the Martha Stewart glitter line, which you can get at the craft store or order online. Pick out your colors and make sure that you have a matching set of both fine and hexagonal glitter. I'm gonna do shades of blue and green on my left hand since I have warm shades on my right. Start with clean nails and apply a gel base coat, which I have already done to speed up this tutorial. Next, I'm mixing the base coat of fine glitter by using a thick, clear, structured gel polish polish, which usually comes in a little pot. Use a paper plate or aluminum foil to mix the gel and glitter together, creating a thick paste. I'm applying this glitter paste with a flat synthetic nail brush all over my nails. You need this base of fine glitter to fill in any gaps that will naturally happen when placing the hexagonal glitter later. Don't skip this step. To place the hexagonal glitter, I'm giving myself a little dab of the clear structure gel and using an orange stick, which is a wood manicure stick, made slightly sticky with a dunk in the clear gel to pick up one piece of hexagonal glitter at a time. You won't have to wet the orange stick every time to pick up a new piece, so this process actually moves pretty quickly. It becomes a bit of a puzzle around the outer edges of your nails. I want to make sure that I have as much surface area of nail covered with hexagons without having them hang over the edge of my nails. This is where the base coat of glitter in a matching color is essential because you don't need to go to the very edges of your nail with the hexagon. Now I'm curing my two layers of glitter in the LED UV light, which is from the sensational nail kit that I got at the drugstore, which hopefully beeps after a minute of curing so you know when the time is up. Moving on, I'm repeating the same steps on the rest of my nails, but using different colors of glitter. To really seal the glitter in, I'm next doing a thick coat of the structured gel all over my nails. And don't forget to seal the tips as well. Now I'm curing this thick coat for a couple minutes in the UV light. If you're doing the manicure with regular polish, you may want to use some nail glue to apply the hexagonal glitter and seal with multiple coats of a strong, clear top coat. I'm adding a final coat of shine with a regular gel top coat and then curing again one more time in the light. The gel cleanser helps to remove any sticky residue from the gel and my final step is always using a nail file to clean up any rough or overflowing edges from the hardened cured gel. And I'm done. Let's take it to the red carpet. enjoy this tutorial please give it a thumbs up if you did also please comment below and let me know if you have any questions and just what you think in general because I love hearing from you and make sure to subscribe to my channel as well because we have a constant flow of inspiring videos coming at you and if you want to watch more right now you can click on this fun video playing beside me hello all right see you later bye yes using acrylic paint to paint flowers on my nails. The acrylic paint is so much easier to get a very painted look instead of nail polish, which is a lot more runny and glossy. I got flowers on my nails. Mr. Keith.